Good morning, I'm Howard Monroe with your morning digital news brief for this Monday, December 11th. This morning was a snowy start for many of you. Overnight, the rain turned to snow in some parts, including here in Quakertown. The rain snow showers are part of a powerful storm system that brought record rainfall to our area and caused some flooding and ponding. The good news is that most of that rain and snow has already cleared out of our area. Cape Bilo's forecast for today is just moments away. Two Philadelphia Highway Patrol officers are recovering after they were shot while on duty in Philadelphia's Holmesburg neighborhood over the weekend. One of those officers remains hospitalized in stable condition. The other officer was treated and released. The gunman, who was shot by police, is in critical condition at Jefferson, Jefferson Torresdale Hospital. Per standard protocol, all four officers involved have been placed on administrative leave. And now back to your weather. Some changes are coming now that the rain and snow has moved on through meteorologist Kate Bylos here. Hey, Kate. Hey there, Howard. Yeah, we are looking at some big time changes out there in the wake of our next weather alert. Now we are seeing skies clearing. I was just looking at some rainfall totals. We picked up over three inches of rain in parts of the area, but now the sun expected for the afternoon. You'll need the sunglasses for the afternoon commute. Sun returning in the wake of that rain, which is moving up through New England here today. But there are still some flooding concerns along our local waterways. So streams, creeks, even the larger rivers in some spots, areas that are prone to flooding. If you live by or travel along these roadways adjacent to local waterways, you will see uh, uh, once again the risk for some localized flooding concerns throughout today, even as the sun comes out. But it's much colder and very windy with gusts to 35 miles per hour. Today, again, turning out mostly sunny. That rain snow from the morning has come to an end. It's windy and colder at 46 degrees for today's high. And you can see our storm system departing the area, taking the rain and the snow that some spots saw earlier today with it. But now before we had a good dose of rain over Sunday into Monday, again, where you see that bright pink, that's over three to four inches of rain around Philadelphia, an inch to two inches where you see the brighter oranges and reds, that's about two inches of rain that came down earlier today. Later this afternoon, we'll be dealing with strong gusty winds, and then tonight, the winds die down just a bit. We've got much nicer weather expected as we take you through the end of the week. High pressure in control, chilly through Thursday, then a little warm up as we head into Friday and the weekend. Howard, I'll send it back over to you. All right, thank you, Kate. Remember, you can always get Kate's most up to date forecast and also the latest stories right here at CBSPhiladelphia.com. That's the latest for this morning digital news brief. I'm Howard Monroe. Have a great day.